Hey guys, uh, thanks for watching. Uh, today is April 11th. Right now is 6 p.m. Um, today uh, I have here is the snail lax, snail lax um, massage chair cushioner. Um, I just got this in the mail. Um, when it first came in, this is basically what you see. It's a pretty good sized box. Um, this box weighs about maybe 18 pounds, roughly 18 pounds, uh, directly shipped from Arizona. I actually bought this at the website. Let me see what's the website called. Uh, the website I got this from is called Dollar Hawk. It's called Dollar Hawk. A um, little bit information about this model uh, is that uh, this is the model SL234. Uh, I know that on the Amazon, I believe there was a uh, there was a lot of people buying uh, different model. I think it was a uh, model SL one sixty two or something. But I believe this is a older model. Um, the model number is SL two three four. The power in these is a thirty six watt. Um, import is a twelve uh, DC um, 3.0, 3.0 a uh, I believe that's the amp, 3 amp. Uh, the size is 31.5 times 6.9 times 18.3 inches. So that's probably the length, the width, and yeah. And then the weight is 16 pounds. So the the cushion, the, the massage chair cushion itself is 16 pounds. Uh, but with the whole box, it's roughly about 18 pounds. Uh, it's obviously it's made in China. A lot of products is actually made in China. So yeah, let's open this. So again, this is model is SL234. Um, I believe the retail price for this is close to two or three hundred dollars. I don't exactly remember, it, but the one that I bought this is actually brand new. Um, the website listed as an open model, so I'm not, I'm not sure. <coughs> Uh, it's actually listed as an open box, so I'm not sure why is it open box. Maybe it's because it's a demo model or for some reason. But anyway, I got this for really cheap. I believe I got this for close to a hundred dollar or I think under a hundred dollar, maybe sixty or seventy dollar, just because it's an open box. But the website listed as a brand new um, massage chair. So anyway, let's uh, open this really quick. So you could obviously tell that it's an open model because they put a lot of tape on it and not just anywhere, they just put it all over places, uh, areas that shouldn't have any tape, they actually put it as well. I don't have a cardboard cutter so I'm just using my scissors right now for this and it's working so far so good. I try not to break the box extremely bad just in case if I need to return it. But I doubt that I'm going to return it, but still, I don't want to rip it like crazy. So, yeah, that's why. Try my best, you know. It's not perfect, obviously, if you can tell. So this is actually my first time buying it, uh, any massage chair. I'm not really sure about the brand itself, the, 
snail wax, but I saw a pretty good review on it. So, so by the way, when you open it, it has a bubble wrap on it. So, and yeah. Okay, after you take this out, it's just a regular chair. It does not have a bag with it, but obviously they list it as a open model, so it does not have a bag. I'm gonna put this aside. Let me see what else will come with it. Uh, that's it, it's just a plug. There is no instruction or anything like that. No instruction, just a, a cable. Set this aside. Um, first of all, it looks pretty clean. Uh, let me see if it, has, if it has a remote. It should come with the remote. There we go. So you got yourselves a remote. And looks really good condition. It does seem like it's been used. It does have a, a tiny wear on the back. Where the sticker is kind of faded out. So I'm assuming someone sort of used it. Or well, maybe it is the demo model. Like I was saying, and on the right side, you also have the power cord where you plug in. So, try that. Okay, it seems okay, the power cord. So, I'm going to test it out. Um, you could actually install this in your car or also in a, any regular seat or on a couch. Okay, so I kind of hooked it up on the chair at this moment. Um, behind the, the cushion, it has a two Velcro that you could stick with on the chair. But usually, you don't want the chair to be straight up like that. You want it to be a little bit in the, I guess, incline. incline. But right now, I don't have an incline chair. So this is the only thing that I could have. Um, you have two bulging. Uh, machine right here. I don't know what they call it. Maybe a roller for your neck. This is for your neck and this also for your back um, The bulge part is right here. This two bulgy part it actually goes along the rail go all the way to the top I'm not really sure what this thing does. I'm sure you probably could remove it or something But I'm just gonna leave it on for now and then a little bit dusty and then here's the remote and the back side, it does have a little bit of wear on it right here where the tape kind of come off. So I'm assuming someone probably used it already. So I plugged the power in ready and let's test this out. You have an opening right here for you to store the remote if you want to stick it in. So let's quickly check this out. Hope you guys can see me. Let me angle this. Adjust this side, guys. How's that? Seems pretty good. All right, let's try this. Okay, let's turn it on. So, on the bottom where you're sitting on, this thing's supposed to heat up. It has a heating feature. Um, it, I will first thing. First thing that I noticed, it doesn't really touch my neck yet. It's actually on my shoulder. These two bulging, it's right here on my shoulder. So let's turn on the power. Lights up. First thing I'm feeling right now is the lower back. And yes, it's my lower back and slowly going up. Right now it's in my metal back. And it's going circular feeling. Circular feeling is slowly going up. Slowly going up. Now it's close to my upper back. Let's get my neck started. Uh, so they also have a heating feature. Okay, so right now it's going down. I 
you'll feel it's going down. So if you hit the heat uh, intensely, okay. So right now it's in the low speed. When it's in low speed, I mean low intensely. When it's low in low intensely, the speed is high. So which means it go faster up and down, up and down faster. But if you increase the intensity by clicking on the intensely high, then the speed slow down. It, yes, it push a little bit harder. I could feel it pushing it harder, but the speed itself is is not as fast. It's going slowly up. So it's going slowly up. Let me try the neck. I haven't turned this on yet. Okay. So it's not really my neck, it's on my shoulder right now, it's moving, it's going circular motion. Circular motion. So all three is lights up right now. The chair, the neck, the back, and the lower back. It's all lights up. And on the bottom selection, currently it's highlighted as a full back. It's not lower back or upper back, it's full back right now. So the whole machine is working right now. So in order for me to feel my neck, I guess I just had to uh, scooch down a little bit. So I'm gonna try that by scooting down a little bit and then have them work my neck. Yes, now I feel it. And I also, I'm not sure what this vibration is, but I'm gonna try to hit this vibration and see what happens. Oh, okay, I feel the vibration so underneath. It's about basically my butt so is vibrating. So they don't have a massage thing for the, they don't have a motor for your butt, but they do have a, um, a vibration uh, for your butt. And they also have a heat too. You could turn on the heat if you want, but I don't want the heat. I'm turning that off. And yeah, that's it. Let me see what this do. Uh, these are just directional up and down where you want the motor to be but I guess I just going to set it as auto where they do your whole body yep. so that's pretty cool how do you guys like it okay let me uh, let me see if they have a pause button I'm just gonna turn this off it, I, I, it doesn't come with the instructions, so I'm not sure if they have a pause button, but I just turned the power off. And then I'm going to grab my mom and have her try it, see if she likes it. Okay, so my mom's never bit shorter, so let's try her. Hey, hey, you think fine, fine. Okay. So, So she said that she didn't, she doesn't like it. Uh, let me try the vibration on too. So if you could tell, um, the the neck part it does it does not directly touch the neck. It's a little bit towards the shoulder and the neck. So I guess both in between the neck. Uh, the back motor, it actually goes up and down. It goes up and down and up and down. And then for the butts, it's just a vibration. It does not have a motor on it. And this is Buster. Uh, excuse me, Cupcake. Buster is over here, standing next to me. <laughs> um, I don't remember how much I got this for. But this is a what they listed as a brand new open model. So since it's open, it does not have any instruction. So I'm assuming this is a demo model where they probably use it in the store or something. And so that's why they sold it really cheap. I don't remember exactly the price, but it's under $100. Um, I believe it's probably, yeah, I think it was $50. Either fit, yeah. I'm actually pretty sure it's fifty dollar. Yeah. Um, let me see what else. Also, for the remote control, it does not have a timer, so I don't see a timer on it. So unless you hit the power, then I'll turn it off. Oh, that's a Buster right there. Oh, Buster. 
and then yeah so that's about it hope you guys like the video um i put the remote control on the table but obviously there's a sl sleeve for it right next to the chair where you could put it in that's all